You heard what you wanted to hear, believed what you wanted to believe. And now the only one who has gained anything from all of this is... Me. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 moments from the Star Wars animated series. <laughs> for this list, we'll be going over some of the most notable bits from animated shows in the Star Wars franchise. Naturally, there will be spoilers. If there's a forceful cartoon Star Wars moment whose presence you missed on our list, tell us in the comments. Do it! Number 10. True Colors – Star Wars Visions Visions has some fantastic episodes, but one of the most universally praised is the Ninth Jedi. Set in the far future, or closer to the present based on the long time ago in a galaxy far, far away dynamic, it brings so many cool ideas to the table, including lightsabers that change colors based on the wielder. This plays into a brilliant twist. <laughs> At a meeting of potential new Jedi, eight Force users arrive. At first, only one, Ethan, activates a lightsaber, which turns blue. However, when the others activate their blades, they turn red, revealing that most of them are dark side users. This well-executed reveal, as well as the ensuing battle, helped an already standout episode be that much more enjoyable. Number 9. Order 66 – Star Wars The Clone Wars While everyone who's seen Revenge of the Sith knows about Order 66, the brainwashing directive for clones to kill their Jedi commanders Seeing this again still hits hard. After Ahsoka senses Anakin's fall to the dark side through the Force, Rex receives a transmission to execute Order 66. While he manages to resist it briefly, he still turns on his young friend. Find him. Fight. Find him! Fight! <laughs> Ahsoka fleeing the loyal clones who fought by her side for years is both an excellent action scene and a heartbreaking one all at once. While the slaughter of the Jedi is tragic, the Clone Wars makes it clear that it's equally awful for the clones forced to do it. Sir, are you alright? Fine, just tired as all. I want you to go to the detention level. Execute Maul. Yes, sir. Alright, man. Number 8. Mace Windu vs. Droids – Star Wars Clone Wars The original Clone Wars animated series can sometimes be overlooked, but it really shouldn't be because of scenes like this. While battling against droids on Dantooine, Mace Windu is separated from his lightsaber by a huge shockwave creating ship. Using only the Force and his bare hands, Windu takes on huge swaths of battle droids by himself. The choreography is among the most creative and badass in the entire franchise. Windu caps off the scene by leaping up into the enormous ship and bringing it down from the inside. Internal explosions all over. We are losing control. What? The little boy who witnesses all this will probably never stop telling the story, and will never stop revisiting this amazing set piece. Number 7. Kanan's Sacrifice – Star Wars Rebels Rebels may have a reputation as being one of the more kid-friendly Star Wars animated series, but that doesn't mean it doesn't have darker and more tragic moments. I love you. Must be the truth here I'm talking. No. Me. All me. During a mission to rescue Hera, Jedi Knight Kanan Jarrus tries to get her out via a fuel depot. After Hera's declaration of love, the Empire fires on the depot, igniting the fuel just as their transport arrives. In 
order to save the woman and crew he loves, Kanan uses the force to hold back the explosion and pushes Hera away when she tries to save him. It's among the more noble and emotional deaths in Star Wars. Number 6. Ahsoka Leaves the Jedi – Star Wars The Clone Wars After Ahsoka is framed for a crime she didn't commit, she goes on the run. While Anakin stands by his apprentice and fights to expose the culprit, the rest of the Council gives in to pressure to expel her from the Order. It is the Council's opinion that Padawan Ahsoka Tano has committed sedition against the Republic, and thus she will be expelled from the Jedi Order. This scene begins on a seemingly positive note, with Ahsoka getting welcomed back to the Order after she's been proven innocent. Except Ahsoka declines the invitation, feeling betrayed and wanting to find her own path. I'm sorry, Master, but I'm not coming back. A beautifully rendered moment sees Anakin relate her feelings to his own, foreshadowing his own break from the Jedi. I understand. More than you realize, I understand wanting to walk away from the Order. I know. It's a quiet, sad moment, but it feels momentous both for the characters and the series as a whole. Number 5. Obi-Wan and Maul's Final Duel – Star Wars Rebels Maul and Obi-Wan Kenobi have a long history together, with plenty of animosity from both sides. Here the former Sith Lord finally catches up with the Jedi on Tatooine. Look what has become of you, a rat in the desert. Look what I have risen above. Fireside in the desert, Maul berates Kenobi for living in squalor, but Obi-Wan counters that Maul has nothing either. Maul then discerns that Obi-Wan is there to protect someone. Perhaps you are protecting something? No, protecting someone. The duo then draw their lightsabers and have a tense standoff before a brief clash of blades, which results in Maul's death. As he lays dying, Maul asks Kenobi if he's protecting the Chosen One, which he erroneously confirms, giving his old foe a last new hope. He will avenge us. It may not be a complicated fight, but its impact and gravitas are top-notch. Number 4. General Grievous' Debut – Star Wars Clone Wars ah! no! General Grievous, the cyborg droid general, corners some Jedi in a downed Republic ship and, rather than kill them with his army, offers them warrior's deaths. Grievous then proceeds to take on half a dozen Jedi by himself. Grievous's mechanical body allows him to use lightsabers in then heretofore unseen ways, spinning them rapidly, wielding them with his feet, and even attacking from the ceiling. He even kills several Jedi and leaves two of the survivors sorely wounded. <laughs> He may take a lot of L's throughout most of the franchise, but General Grievous made a terrifying first impression. Number 3. Ahsoka vs. Darth Vader – Star Wars Rebels When Ahsoka showed up in Rebels, the idea of this confrontation entered fans' heads. But when it finally happened, it surpassed all expectations. It was foretold that you would be here. Our long-awaited meeting has come at last. I'm glad I gave you something to look forward to. In a Sith temple, Darth Vader has Ezra Bridger cornered when Ahsoka appears. She expresses disbelief that Vader and Anakin can be the same person, and promises to do a very un-Jedi thing and avenge the man her former master was. Revenge is not the Jedi way. I am no Jedi. Their battle is fraught with emotion, as well as excellent atmosphere and music. 
It concludes, initially anyway, with Ahsoka exposing Vader's face and him speaking to her in an unaltered voice. She also promises not to leave her friend again, despite his promise to kill her. I won't leave you. Not this time. Then you will die. While not the best animated fight, it's still an all-time great. Number 2. Ahsoka vs. Maul – Star Wars The Clone Wars Your vision is flawed. I see the Padawan needs one last lesson. When Ahsoka meets Maul on Mandalore, the villain proves surprisingly persuasive. Unfortunately for the galaxy, but not for us, Ahsoka doesn't believe Maul's claims that Anakin has been groomed to be Sidious' apprentice and engage him in battle. And what an epic fight it is. Given that it's achieved partly through motion capture, the choreography feels grounded yet extremely well done. The fight ranges from a throne room to support beams high above the city and concludes with Ahsoka capturing the dark side user. The music, dialogue, and action all throughout are 11s out of 10. While The Clone Wars continues for a couple episodes after this, if the show had ended with this fight, it would have gone out on a truly colossal high. Before we get to our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. A Funeral for the 501st, Star Wars The Clone Wars. Good soldiers follow orders, and they were the best. Krell vs. Clones, Star Wars The Clone Wars. A dark and atmospheric fight against a rogue Jedi. You dare to attack a Jedi! <laughs> Geonosis Assault, Star Wars The Clone Wars. This puts the war in Clone Wars. The destruction of Topoka City, Star Wars The Bad Batch. The clone's home sinks beneath the waves. Hosnian Prime is destroyed, Star Wars Resistance. Starkiller Base's destruction gets a lot more personal. CB-23, what system was that? <laughs> Hosnian Prime. No, 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 that can't be. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Anakin's Vision of the Future – Star Wars The Clone Wars Welcome. I believe there has been a misunderstanding. We really don't have to be enemies. Animated shows have foreshadowed Anakin's destiny several times. Although his cave vision in the 2D Clone Wars series is quite good, we elected for the distinctly less subtle occasion from the follow-up. On the realm of Mortis, Anakin seeks to stop the Sun, a personification of the dark side, maybe. To persuade him, the Sun shows Anakin his future. We see glimpses of Anakin's fall to the dark side, as well as his actions after the rise of the Emperor. It all culminates in a looming Vader helmet. No! Perhaps fittingly, Anakin makes a similar choice as his future self, joining a powerful villain in the name of peace. It's the past, present, and future of Star Wars wrapped up in one moment. Will we bring peace? Of course. Do you agree with our picks? 
Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.